Hi. Okay, so I realized I didn't post a makeup video on Sunday and I was totally going to, but then I got sick and that wasn't fun. And I mean, while I was still in bed, you know, I had a ton of time to think about stuff and I was like, okay, well, since I'm running out of a ton of stuff and I'm sick and my mom wants to go to the mall tomorrow, I should get some new makeup tomorrow that I'm not going to run out of for a while. So I went today and I was going to get... I was gonna get a bunch of bare mineral stuff because that's what I usually use and it works really well for my skin. It's not just about animals, most products are vegan, but it's expensive. And I don't have a job right now because I'm in track. So, we went to Target. See, maybe we can come up with cheaper stuff. It isn't best for an animal, which usually doesn't happen. Found out Elf, which I've seen a ton of great reviews for from people on Instagram and Pinterest, YouTube, it is not tested on animals. So it's on the bottom. Okay. No animal testing. Can you read that? Not really. Well, too bad. It says it on the bottom. Okay. So, we went and got a bunch of elf stuff because it's cheaper, and I got some new brushes and makeup, so I'm going to show you that. So, first thing I got, foundation. It's the, uh, just basic liquid foundation. I don't know if color you can see that right there. I like to wear two shades of foundation, one darker one, just make everything match, get rid of my scar. I used to have really bad, like, cystic acne, so I'd have, like, ones in a month, but it'd be, like, this big. So I have a bunch of little circle scars because I'm tan and they're white in the center and dark on the outside. They don't match my actual skin. So I like to use one darker shade of foundation on first to just make all of that go away. And then I put a lighter one on top. So I still have a ton of the leftover gasp tester. But leftover, I did not buy it. I did not support this um, Avon foundation that my mom gave me because she stopped using it and she had a bunch left over. Um, so I still have a bunch of that, so when that runs out, I'm going to buy a lighter shade of this, and then I'll have both foundation the elf. And then I also got gel eyeliner, well this is cream, but cream eyeliner. I've been using that a couple times, borrow from my friends if I forget to put on makeup before school, and I think it works a lot better than liquid or pencil. It's darker, it's easy to put on, it doesn't have to dry, that's a problem when you're and you're like, wing, and then you blink, and then it's up here. <laughs> so, that's good. And then this is an elf, this is NYC because I couldn't find a white elf. And I'm pretty sure this isn't tested on animals either. I think it was like a dollar. Just a white giant eyeshadow. And I could use it as eyeshadow or like do the waterline, make it look bigger. And oh, concealer. It's running out of the again leftover one that my mom had. So obviously under the eyes is really important because I like to stay up. And then, got some brushes. Big giant powder brush, because I don't even have one. Like, I was just like, using a brush brush to put powder on, and I stopped wearing powder for a long time. You can't get your whole face. So, giant brush. Yes. And then, a technically for contouring brush, but I already have like three of these that I use with my bronzers. So this one's for blush, because all I had for blush was the little crappy ones that come in the compact and those are bad and they're falling apart by now so actual one and I it works anyway because I do my blush up here I don't do the apples and finally flat eyeshadow brush because I had one double-ended one the angle side is fine the round side is completely shot by now so got a new one so I'm gonna be filming and posting hopefully a makeup tutorial tomorrow because I didn't do one on Sunday so be watching for that I'm gonna be using all of these new products in it and I'm super excited. So thanks, um, like and subscribe this video and all my others watch because they're awesome-ish. Um, and yeah, check out my Instagram, Twitter, two of my blogs are below. Thanks for watching, love you guys.